guys what's up welcome back to our techies and in this video i gonna show you how to fix uh, frp lock problem on samsung devices so basically this is the another one method for uh, in 2018 for frp unlock and it's uh, work on uh, different samsung models uh, like uh, z1 z5 it's work on that kind of phones so right now it says z1 in my hand and it's also work for z2 series basically in j series it's uh, definitely work and you can also try on other uh, other uh, Samsung device if you stuck on the FRP lock so first of all let's uh, check it out there it's asking for the verify your account and so first of all let's directly um, simply uh, start the okay simply start the um, press the three times and talkback will be start so simply start the talkback setting so and simply write uh, something like L okay and this uh, setting will be appears so you require to select the talkback setting by tapping two times over that uh, talkback setting and then simply open the now you can turn off the talkback setting and simply select the uh, in the very bottom the privacy policy and while uh, selecting the privacy policy you will you will get, you can see the browser option appears means you can browse any website uh, anything this will appears so now uh, let's simply search for a google account manager so simply search for it and then uh, and it's must be google account manager 5.1 so and simply open it and let's simply download this google account manager and simply where it is download okay download this apk and simply download and install it okay it's uh, downloaded okay select the okay and open it setting check mark the unknown sources and install it okay now open the google account manager uh, so you can see it, we can't open it it's simply done we can't open that google account uh, manager so after that you require to again download a another apk that is quick shortcut maker you require to download this quick shortcut maker and uh, from there or simply search for quick shortcut maker anime trick so just open it and and simply download for this uh, quick uh, shortcut maker universal and then simply open it uh, download and okay and then open it and again install it install the quick shortcut maker and now you can see that we can open this so require to open it and simply uh, search here for the google uh, account manager simply search for the google account manager and you will find uh, this uh, three option in this option and select the google account manager and in the uh, google account manager you, can, you require to find uh, something like email and type email and type select the google account manager and here you will find that uh, type email and the password so required to select that uh, google in google account manager type email and the password and simply uh, select it and try it and now you required to open it with a browser sign in and you required to sign up with your um, uh, google account means a gmail account just simply sign it sign in it and
okay now after that required to uh, sign in with the uh, password also required to sign in and give the password and when you see uh, it's uh, done means uh, sign in completed you will again jump on this screen and then you require to simply uh, turn on your means uh, reboot your phone or restart your phone so simply let me restart it okay first okay simply let restart it and now the phone is going to restart so it's a gold j1 4g samsung galaxy j1 4g okay now okay now the phone you can see it's uh, on so let's see uh, next next agree okay checking the connection and okay now here it is account has been added automatically and setup is completed now and so here it is uh, it's everything now completed you can see it's uh, completely now bypass there is also two uh, uh, like uh, application also here already that is dna uh, dev setting and the another one is the quick shortcut maker dev setting is for the google account manager and this one quick shortcut maker so if you want to use the phone here with the previous uh, gmail account then you can use it or if you wanna just uh, uh, use a new gmail id on that then you re simply require to uh, you simply require to format the simply phone again just completely uh, uh, factory data reset the phone and reset the device erase everything so now uh, the phone is uh, going to reset and and the, this time uh, it will take around one and one and a half minutes to reset the phone completely let's check it out
okay it's now seems to be on and see installing the applications right now and okay now the phone gets on and let's see again next so here you can see it's a uh, simply bypassed I means uh, simply just uh, jumped on the next screen it does not require to uh, connect with the Wi-Fi so it's simply done skip skip anyway more more next and simply it's done it's jump on the uh, home screen finish so here it is uh, this is the way in that way you can easily uh, remove frp lock from your samsung phone if you like this video then please click on thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe this video thanks for watching this